Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang, and we're here to talk about how to calculate resultant weight using the Law of Sines. Now, Law of Sines is a very useful tool here, and uh, when you're trying to find the resultant weight, you're actually using the formula in a very similar way as you would regular sides, except that you're talking about forces as opposed to sides of uh, triangles. So let's talk about how this formula works. So you have A over sine of alpha equals B over sine of beta equals R over sine of phi. Now, alpha, beta, and phi are angles, which you will need, but, in, but A and B are forces that are acting on the situation, and R is the resultant weight. So the idea here is, if you plug in the pieces here, you'll be able to find the resultant weight as a result of forces A and B and the corresponding angles. So plug in and you should be good to go. So I'm Jimmy Chang and that's how to find the resultant weight using the law of signs.